Okay, here's my review of the MyUI version 4. Um, this is 2.6.8 on the HTC Jordan Incredible. You can see it's on Verizon. You get the page full of toggles. No notifications, but you get a 3G and a 1X for voice and stuff. Um, and if you tap it, I don't know if I... No, you tap that, it goes to calendar. That's, that's actually pretty cool. Most ROMs don't go to calendar when you tap that. But the one X is the voice, 3 gs data, then have the Wi-Fi. Um, you can press and hold on something too in it. I like the transition fix. Let's go on to settings. You can, you can go over to common settings. Or let's just go into complete settings. Let's go to about phone. You can see 4.0.4, .4, incredible 2. 1 gigahertz, 768 megabytes of RAM. Um, this has its Cyanogen Mod Kernel by Aero Evan. Let's go back. Device. Oops, I'm not sure what button is. Oh, this is where you can set your buttons. Let's go back. Um, status bar. Customize toggles position. Collapse after clicks. Um, so I mean, just like common status bar settings. Let's go back. Display, sound, Wi Fi. Um, everything's working on here, but everything's working but the camera flash on stock camera and usual ICS camera problems. So let's check out the camera. I'm not sure what usual ICS camera problems are because everything else seems to be working pretty fine on other, like AOKP -OK for the camera and stuff. So let's take a picture of that. Camera's kind of slow, but I mean, it, it still works. Let's go into menu. Let's try video. Oops. Yeah. Okay, let's go. New. Sorry, I'm trying to do this through the camera. Let's click settings, 720p. Let's see if it works. So 720p, no. That does not work. Um, what kind of apps do you get? Let's see. I just booted this up. So you get super super su myui.us. You get updater, recommended. It's gtalk. Um, places, navigation, map. You get a lot of map features on this. You can ice like the ICS folders though. So if you want all of those location stuff in one folder, you get Goo Manager, News and Weather, Root Browser, um, another MyUI US thing, MyUI US, Gmail, Google Voice, Play Store. You get Titanium Backup on this. Um, I think the keyboard's the stock. Okay, let's just go to new message. Type message. Yeah, see, I mean, you get the stock ICS keyboard. Let's go back. Let's go to phone. You get the My US, the My UI. Very responsive. Um, let's go to tools. You get torch on this one too. You get permission thing for super user, firewall. Uh, you get compass. It's kind of cool. Not really seen many ROMs come with compass. Let's try the torch. So the torch doesn't have like the flash thing, but as you can see, sorry for blinding you. 
but as you can see the torch still works. You can quickly open flashlight by holding home when in lock screen. So let me show you guys the lock screen too by the way. Here's the lock screen. You get camera, messaging, phone, and then unlock it. Let's see, let's, let's go to camera. Alright, so camera. Camera's kind of failing me right now. Let's close that out. My UI has their own kind of uh, task manager than uh, Sock ICS. I, I kind of like theirs. Theirs is actually pretty cool. And it even tells you like the RAM up there. As you can see, I got 488. Try to back that up. 488 at 768. Camera. Let's close that. Um, what is, um, I don't know what this is. Uh, this this goes to your running services, and I'm I'm assuming this closes them all out. Yeah, so that's pretty cool. And then it, it tells you how much memory to clean out. Let's go back to the lock screen. Pressing hold home. Oh, and you can see it it does pop up. That's kind of like AOKP where you like press and hold the power button. You can't bring down the notification now. That that's kind of sucks. Everything launches pretty quick. Um, here are like stock <coughs> bookmarks. Uh, you get Windows, so you can swipe away your wind. Let's let's add one. Let's just add a, a new window. Um, let's add another one. So we have four so far. Okay, now we have five. So these are the recent windows. You swipe up. I don't know if you can swipe. Yeah, so you, you swipe up to get rid of them. So that's pretty cool. Swipe up. It's kind of buggy. But I mean, it's, it still works really well. Go over. Got history on this side. You got back, forward, assuming that's home. Let's go back. Let's try out the music player. It filters fires, files under 800 kilobytes. Like that way you don't have like a ringtone under your music. Uh, let's, let's go to all songs, see how this looks. It doesn't really look anything like Apollo on um, CM9. Uh, I really don't want to open any of these music, sorry. You don't really want to open those. Um, okay. It's loading. Yeah, not sure what those are. That's in Japanese. We're not going there. <laughs> um, themes. Let's go to online. The, the Transformers one, like the lock screen, is pretty sweet. Not sure why it's taking so long. These are just like a few of the themes that you can switch to. Um, let me show you this one, Black Ice. Let's download it. It's downloading. You can see up here. Wow, it's taking a while. So let's hit home. See if there's anything else. If you hit home on the home screen, no, I think you pinch out. Do you pinch out? Yeah. You pinch out. You can scroll through your home screen. You can add new ones. Let's see what kind of widgets there are. Um, let's get rid of this clock. Let's see what kind of clocks they have. Focus in. Um, let's go to this clock, 2x4. So, there's a flip clock, that's kind of cool. Photo frames, you got a music widget, music widget, contacts, photo gallery. 
So these are some of the widgets that you get. You can make a new folder too. Not sure why that's on there, because you can just pick up one, put it on top of the other to make a folder, but let's refocus that. Okay, so let me this is almost done. I don't know why my Wi-Fi is being kind of slow. I don't know if, if it's my internet or maybe it's the servers that hold these themes. I'm not sure. I, I just up uploaded a YouTube video, so I don't, I don't think it's my Wi-Fi. Okay, now let's go back. Let's go to local. Let's go to this one and hit apply. Let's go to apply and reboot, and then you can also see the boot animation. So this is the boot animation that comes with this theme, the stock ICS boot animation. Um, on, on just like the stock theme that comes with this ROM, you get like where it says my UI in the middle. So as you can see the icons kind of changed. Oh, and also you, you can add stuff into the dock bar too. I don't know if, if you can add folders in here though. So you, you can't add folders, but I'm pretty sure that you can put folders in there. And let's take this folder and see if you can add it. Yeah, it's, it's like you can put folders in there, but you can't like merge those that are, that are down there. So the music kind of changed, like the Google Music, or Play Music, sorry. Um, Super SU doesn't have the box around it. Goo Manager. So these don't have the boxes around them. That looks kind of like the Google search widget now. Let's go to Tool, see if anything in here has changed. The clock looks like the stock ICS. Let's go to Phone. Phone didn't really change. Start Contacts. So I mean, like, just like the look of it kind of changes with the uh, themes. Let's see if the lock screen will pop up. Oh. So, not sure <laughs> what's up with the lock screen. Let's go back to music though, because that icon changed. Okay, the icon changes, but the what's in there doesn't. Alright, so that was my UI on um, the HTC Droid Incredible 2 version 4 ICS the 2.6.8 build